What's up guys, Teclash here and today we are going to test out the speed of internal storage in OnePlus 7 Pro. Now if you don't know, OnePlus 7 Pro is the first phone to come with UFS 3.0 which essentially means that the storage on this phone is the fastest storage on any smartphone till date. Now this is a very big thing but the interesting part here is that the cable you actually get with OnePlus 7 Pro is a USB 2.1 cable which means that if you are transferring any data using this cable then there is going to be a bottleneck of the cable and the maximum data speed that you are going to get is very low as compared to the actual speed of the device. So to test out the actual speed we are going to use an external SSD from Samsung. It's a one terabyte portable SSD called the T5 and it has insane speeds. Also the interesting part is the cable which comes with Samsung T5 is actually USB 3.1 which means that this is going to provide us the maximum speed which we need to test out this device. So I don't want to further waste your time I'm just going to jump into the file manager I'm just going to plug this device in and uh, Okay, I have plugged the T5 in and I'm waiting for it to show up and here it is Samsung T5 there is 305 GB of the data which is stored in my external hard drive so I'm just going to copy the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus folder which has some video files and I'm going to copy it to the internal storage on my device. Now before I do that I'm just going to start the timer so we can see how much time it actually takes to transfer 11 gigabytes of this data. So it almost took around 32 seconds. I was slow to turn off this uh, timer. So we are considering it as 32 seconds and the data on that folder was around 11.21 gigabytes which essentially means that the MB, the per uh, second MB speed is going to be 358 megabytes per second which is an insane speed for a smartphone device and uh, as you can clearly see that OnePlus 7 Pro has UFS 3.0 which means you are going to get insane speeds when you are loading some games. However, I also want to include the fact that this cable with the phone is not essentially the best thing you can get because uh, I was expecting OnePlus to include a USB 3.1 cable to actually take advantage of the insane speeds which OnePlus 7 Pro is capable of. So do let me know about your thoughts regarding OnePlus 7 Pro. Do you think it's the flagship killer that OnePlus supposedly thinks it is? Or do you think it can compete with the likes of iPhone XS Max and Galaxy S10 Plus? So I'm going to wait for your comments and be sure to subscribe to this channel as I will be waiting for you in the next video.